Yo. Oh, no, no. Hey, creepy pasta lovers, and today we are here with Siren Head. Now, we're gonna be playing this game, Siren Head, <laughs> created by Modus Interactive. That should be interesting because, as we can see, he has made a lot of different other scary games, as we can see here. Now, before we jump into Siren Head, we also are gonna be joining one in Roblox that my friend Captain Spinks made because I wanna check it out. I wanna see how similar they are or how different they are from each other. So, that should be awesome. And before we jump into the game itself, let's read a little about Mr. Siren Head. Okay, it says, Siren Head is a fictional cryptid that was created by the artist Trevor Henderson. The fictional creature has accumulated a fan following, which has spawned numerous pieces of fan art and fan-made video games, as this one that we found on Itch.io. And then the origin of Siren Head. On August 18th, 2018, Henderson made a post on his Tumblr and Twitter account that later shown below showed the first known art piece of Siren Head. As of December 2019, the Twitter post accumulated over 1,300 likes and over 260 retweets. Okay, so this is a tweet that he originated Mr. Siren Head. Let's see. Okay, one half. Uh, she was on vacation with her husband, and they were scoping out graveyards on the way, as you do, when she saw it rising out of the old cemetery, big as an old macabre telephone pole. <laughs> Was this some kind of bizarre RP the authorities hadn't gotten wise to yet? My god, look at Siren had just chilling there in the cemetery. <laughs> Alright, so that's that. And so we didn't really get much of Mr. Creepy, like of Siren Head, how he was born or why, how he was created. It was just the origin of himself, like the day he was like made or the day he was put out on the internet where he became famous <laughs> right so it's a creepy pasta as we all know it originated 2018 that's two years ago wow. my god all right so let's go straight into this siren head game this should be pretty awesome oh looks pretty awesome already oh okay nice let's put our volume all the way up <laughs> siren head based on a creature by trevor henderson okay move wild examine right mouse and run shift okay some basic controls my god, oh, we're in the forest. All right, let's see what we're getting ourselves into here. Oh, look, there's a truck. Okay, my old forest service truck. I really should get it washed. Dude, that thing is so rusted and everything. <laughs> right, whatever, man. Ooh, um, Pine Ridge hiking trail, no vehicles allowed. A hiker was reported missing. I was sent here to take a look around for them. Hopefully they're not hurt. My god, all right, so we got a report. With some hiker that's gone like missing out of nowhere. Maybe Mr. Siren had caught him slipping up here, yo. Dude, I see him. I saw him pass. Okay, we can't see him anymore. Oh my god, that is so freaky, yo. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Is that a warning siren? Where could that be coming from? Dude, I swear I saw him pass like right there when, as soon as it started playing. All right. Oh, what is that? It's a backpack. Maybe it belongs to the missing hiker, but why leave it behind? Maybe he was trying to cut some weight so he can run faster or something. I don't know, man, but that siren noise is definitely freaky, man. All right, let's continue on. On this pathway. Like, this is a strange pathway, man. I've never seen a pathway like this. It has walls around it of dirt. It's like you were meant to walk here so you could get doomed. <laughs> right, what is that? A scrap of shirt? Looks like there was a struggle. Oh no, he got his shirt turned off. I mean, ripped apart of him. Scratch marks? These weren't made by any animal I know of. Dude, that is like the most biggest scratch mark I've seen in my life. Yeah, we're definitely gonna get ourselves into an issue here. Oh, look, there's another one. Another one. Four strange scratch marks. All right, I don't know if they're like bloody scratch marks or they just look like that because of the dirt. Okay, there's nothing else around here. I guess we keep going forward. Will you look at that? Another scratch mark, but on the ground. Okay, these scratches seem to lead up here. Dude, do you think it's a good idea that we keep going up this way? <laughs> it's never too late to turn back, buddy. Come on. Let's just turn around and go back home. I think the sirens were coming from this direction. Is there anything there? Okay, so I guess this is more like of a game that you're supposed to find like clues. So we gotta keep our eyes peeled. 
So we won't miss a thing. Why is what is that? What in the hell is that? I should take a closer look. Dude, it looks like a baby or like a little person. <laughs> All right, let's go up closer to see what this is. Could that be? I have to get back to the truck now. Oh my God, okay, so we go back to the truck. What's that noise? <gasps> Yo, oh my God, it's Siren Head. <laughs> no, get away from me. Um, guys, oh my God, no. Run, 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 run. Oh no, please don't get me. Why he's doing the Amber Alert sound. I think it's so creepy, man. Every time I get an Amber Alert, that thing freaks me out. What? Dude, he's right behind us. Okay, let's go back to our truck. He better not start running, I swear. If he starts running, I'm gonna quit the game. Because that is so unfair. You guys saw the size of his legs, right? Oh my god, he's making screaming sounds? Okay, we left him behind. Oh my god, he's coming. All right, never mind. Let's go to our truck before he catches up to us. Dude, run faster. Like, this. Oh my god, they run so slow. Okay, so we made it back to the truck. Assuming we're safe. And we're taking off. Oh! But dude, he yanked us out of the truck and he yeeted us out. <gasps> wow. All right, so I guess you're never safe around Siren Head. I mean, first of all, how can you outrun a guy that is like, how tall is he? Like 20 feet tall? Like, dude, you take one step and like his one step is equivalent to like 50 of your steps. <laughs> That's insane, man. Oh gosh, that was... That was totally something else, man. All right, so now since I was quite short, let's go check out the siren head on Roblox made by my friend, Captain Spink. All right, and here we are in the siren head in Roblox made by my, my friend, Captain Spink. Oh my God, all right, so it looks kind of similar as we can see here. We're like in the creepy forest, but in, in this version, we have a sick car instead of an old rusted truck. All right, a Pine Ridge hiking trail. Will you look at that? All right, let's head on down the pathway. Oh, you can hear Siren Head talking to through his uh, speaker head. <laughs> right, this is pretty deep, I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully, oh look. Is that a scratch mark? I think it is. It is a scratch mark, <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> pretty similar, man. All right, this is pretty neat. All right, so let's keep going down till we cross paths with the one and only Siren Head. Oh, what's up, man? My nephew joined me. All right, pretty neat. Oh, look, there's a city in this one. You can actually see buildings. Unlike the other one, it was just plain forest. But I'm not gonna lie, and this one is just like pathways. We're not finding like, we're not finding like, um, like ripped clothes or like anything. Okay, I take that back, yo. Oh no, <laughs> not the perch sound. I think it's so freaky, yo. Stop it! Stop! <laughs> oh my... Siren Head! Yo, what are you girls doing over here? You hear that? No sound? <laughs> She's playing with no sound, she's scared. Oh no, come on ladies, stop being afraid. Okay, I think we're getting closer to Siren Head. What? It's a dead end. Or is it? Why are the trains moving? <laughs> it's so weird. Oh my god. Yo. Oh. No. No. Oh no. Oh my god. He's chasing me. No. What? We got kicked? You were kicked in this game. Curiosity killed the cat. What? Dude, okay, so this one was actually a little more scarier because the siren head actually chases you. Not like in the other one, you're just walking slowly behind you. <laughs> Dude, I'm not gonna lie, that scared the heck out of me. Right, so I guess that was pretty much it. If you get killed, you get kicked from the game. 
you become a loser for getting killed. <laughs> oh man. All right, you guys, so this was Siren Head. It was pretty awesome if you ask me. If you guys want me to check out any other creepy pastas, let me know in the comments below. Or if I missed anything in the first uh, Siren Head game, let me know in the comments below also. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the amazing support. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to slap the like button. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and turn that notification bell on. And I will see you guys in the next one. Yeet! <laughs>